Here are the latest headlines for April. On April 1st, a welcome ceremony was held at Rackton Crimson House for around 400 new graduates joining Rackton. The theme of this year's ceremony was One, or the Japanese character Ichi, to symbolize a new start for these new recruits, as well as a unified spirit of One Team. In his welcome speech, Mickey spoke about shared practices and culture at Rakuten in the context of the five principles of success. Meanwhile, a representative of the new grad spoke of their common determination to build a career at Rakuten and contribute to society. Oh, On April 2nd, Rakuten and Tohoku University concluded a comprehensive collaboration agreement aimed at creating innovation from the Tohoku region of Japan. To accelerate the implementation of various collaboration projects, the Rakuten Innovation Lab Tohoku has been established on the university campus and will initially focus on healthcare, medical care, robotics, and innovation in human resource development. On April 3rd, Mickey spoke at one of the world's best-known healthcare conferences, Fortune Brainstorm Health 2019, which gathered around 200 leading healthcare thinkers, scientists, entrepreneurs, and investors over two days in San Diego, California, to discuss how technology and business can contribute to improving health. In his role as chairman of the board and CEO at Rakuten Medical, Mickey was invited to speak about pioneering medical advances in curing cancer through photoimmunotherapy. During the session, he commented on his reason for initial involvement in the field, including his personal mission to find a cure for his late father, who had been diagnosed with cancer, as well as his interest as an entrepreneur in innovation and speed of development by Rakuten Medical. On April 3rd, Rakuten Marketing hosted its flagship European event, Dealmaker London, for around 600 attendees to experience a full day of performance marketing education through on-stage presentations and strategy sessions. It also gave publishers and advertisers the opportunity to connect and create partnerships with seven hours of networking time and over 1,000 meetings held. The Golden Link Awards, to honor the region's best in the performance marketing industry, was also held for the first time in London. On April 10th, Rakuten Mobile received approval from Japan's Ministry of Internal Affairs and Communications for the frequency bands necessary to deploy its 5G mobile communications system. With its high data transmission speeds, ultra-low latency, and dynamic multi-connectivity, 5G is expected to become the ICT foundation in the era of AI and IoT, as well as part of the social infrastructure of the 2020s. With 5G, Rakuten aims to not only offer a greater level of convenience to its users, but also utilize the technology in a variety of fields and create new business opportunities to solve social issues and support regional development. See you next time on the Rakuten News Network.